Hey everyone, it's Ebony and welcome to M Fashion. I hope you guys are having a really great summer so far. I am kind of living my version of a hot girl summer, which is cool and different. Um, definitely getting into my swimsuit bag, which you'll see today. And in the spirit of summer, we are going to be doing a swimsuit haul. Now, this is going to be a mixed haul. We got a little bit of Fabletics, a little bit of ASOS, a little bit of Target, a little bit of this, this, and that. And this will not only be swimsuits, but also swimwear, like cover-ups and things like that. So, I hope you guys are ready to get into it because I am. I decided to do swimsuits. I feel like I'm kind of late in the game and doing it, but better late than never. Recently, I've been getting a lot of swimsuits. I've been getting into a lot of different types of cover-ups and exploring and, you know, exploring different cuts, colors, and things like that. And if there's any time to show body, um, it's poolside. I hope you guys are gonna like what I'm gonna show today. I'm giving a little bit of racy, mainly conservative-ish. It depends, it depends on how you look at it. But I'm not gonna waste any more time. We're gonna get right into this haul. But before we do, you've been here and you know me, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell button to know when my videos drop. All right, y'all, let's get into the haul. All right, y'all, so let's start off with the tab of the brown and Target swimsuit. This is the striped dot print puff sleeve one piece, and I'm rocking it in a size 26. Now, I think that's the biggest size it comes in. I'm just showing you all the stretch. Um, I want to say out of all the swimsuits I tried on today, this may have the least amount of stretch in kind of like the openings, arm openings, neckline. But it's super comfortable overall, um, especially once you get it on. The tie is fake, so you can actually take it off and have a different look, but very cute swimsuit overall. All right, y'all, next we have the Miami Heat Ruffle Swimsuit. And I'm rocking this in the color hot pink in the size 3X. Now, this suit is from Curvy Sense, and I'm looking bomb in it. I've had so much wear in the swimsuit. Um, I love this belt, it's super cute. I was worried about wearing a 3X, but it actually is really comfortable and has a ton of stretch. I love the deep V and ruffle design, and I also love um, the back. Even though there's light kind of back coverage, it's not super coverage in the back. But I don't mind it because it makes sense with the design. But it's super cute. Next, we have the Marie Mesh top along with the matching drawstring mini skirt from Fabletics. Now, I'm rocking both of these pieces in a 4X in the print Floral Geo. And as you can see, there's a ton of stretch. Love that for me. Um, I love these drawstrings. You guys know I love a versatile piece, and this is that. You can release the strings and give kind of like a midi skirt look, or you can pull up the strings and give us an asymmetrical look like this, which is cute. Or you can do it like I had it before and have it mini. Um, but the mesh is super breathable. I love the print and how loud it is. It's really a banger cover to have for the pool. Here we have the ASOS Curve Wrap Waist Tie Bikini Top along with the matching bottoms in the color red. Now I'm wearing this in a size 24 US. And honestly, as you can see, I could have went down in the top a little bit. Um, I didn't really know how to tighten this any more than I did already and one of the straps wants to kind of fall out so yeah I kind of went down a size for sure but I think this is a really cute suit especially for the girls that like to show skin there's actually a lot of coverage in the back so that's nice as well here we have the halter tankini with the matching bottoms from Eloquy and I'm rocking a size 26 in the top and a 28 in the bottom only because it didn't have a 26 in the bottom. But as you can see, not a lot of back coverage. It is another suit with minimal back coverage. It does have cups in the top, 
but I don't feel super supported. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I feel like I'm resting right under the cups. Um, and then you just tie the back as well, which makes it easy to put on. Everything has a ton of stretch and I love the print. Um, but I don't know if I love the fit of this. Lastly, we have the mesh pom-pom cover-up set from Curvy Sense. Now I'm rocking this in a 4X and I'm rocking this in this kind of like tropical print. They don't have it in this print anymore, but they do still have it in white. So if you like the look of this, go ahead and cop it in the white while it's still in stock. But I love this two piece, it's so cute. I love the opening slits in the pants. It keeps it really breathable, especially in this hot summer. I love the twist tie. It's just a super cute and sexy two piece. And with it being mesh, that's also great because once again, just adding to the breathability of the set. All right, I hope you guys like the haul. One of my faves from the haul I'm wearing right now, this Fabletics two piece cover up is really doing something for me. Usually I would give you kind of like some logistics about a specific brand, but this is multiple brands, so I'll keep it short. When we're talking about shipping, um, pretty much all these places were pretty quick. Curvy Sense is quick. I would say maybe three to five days you'll get your stuff. Um, Target is pretty quick. I would say about the same range, especially if they have it in stock. ASOS, I have premium delivery. And so I literally got my stuff the next day. And I really advise getting it if you're a big ASO shopper because you are only like paying $30 a year and you're getting free two and one day shipping. And that's really important when you need something cute last minute. Eloquist shipping is pretty standard. I wanna say five to seven or five to eight business days usually. You can obviously upcharge it to get it a little sooner but I think the standard is about that long. And then I will say the longest is probably Fabletics. Usually it takes about six days to eight days, I think. Hopefully I'm not making that up. I'll put it in the video, but it takes a little bit longer if you're doing standard. If you wanna speed up the process, you can. You can pay a little extra for that. But yeah, out of all of them, I would say the fastest for me, it's gonna be ASOS with the premium delivery. Then I will say Curvy Sense is second. Um, Target would be next. Eloquy would be after that. And then Fabletics would be after that. As you saw during the haul, everything is pretty affordable. Nothing was too crazy expensive. And with Fabletics in particular, you're definitely not spending a lot. If you're starting um, a VIP subscription or anything like that. And for the girls who are leery about that, you can skip every time. Just like with Savage Fenty, Adore Me, things like that. You can skip every month and you don't have to pay anything. You're really just signing up to get the deals. Alright y'all, I hope you liked everything I tried on today. I hope you found some stuff that you're like, ooh, I'm about to get it right now. Go to my local pool or the pool of my apartment complex, whatever, and stun on the girls. As always, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video to people you think might be interested. Follow me on my social media so we can be friends. And I'll see you next time. Bye.